Hi, welcome to this question right here. So we're trying to find all the possible values on the number line based on this one right here. So we're not actually going to calculate, we're actually going to draw it, okay? So let's actually start off with the number line right here, okay? So what happened is we have a bunch of numbers here that says x is greater than 6. And at the same time, that x are also less than or equal to 11. So it seems like it's greater than 6 but less than 11. So what I would do is I'll put a 6 down here and I'll put an 11 down here. And then I just need to draw a line to represent that rela relationship there. So I'm going to put a close dot right on top of the 6 and the reason I put a close dot is because it says greater than or equal to. Now we know the number it's the x, which is represented by my number line here, the purple number line here. It's going to go greater than 6. It shouldn't be curly, though. It should be straight. But at the same time, it's also less than or equal to 11. So that's why I put a close dot right here as well. Okay? So there's your number line right there. Okay? And that will represent all the possible numbers between the 6 and 11, which includes like, you know, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 10.5, any numbers between the 6 and 11, inclusively. So that means also including the 6, also includes the 11. Okay? And that's it for this question. Thanks for watching.